What it is, what it is, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Mike Rich, man. What's happening with y'all today? Hope everybody, each and every one of y'all, is having a blessed day today, man. I am in front of Lennox Mall. It just look like a Macy's because uh, I don't like coming in in the main entrance. It'd be too crowded up there. Seems like everybody in Atlanta come to my city and be like, you know what? Let's go to Lennox Mall. Let's just crowd up it. Ain't no other mall worth nothing but Lennox. And I'm telling you. It depends on what you're looking for, honestly. But uh, <laughs> anyway, man. Hey, you looking at? Hey, you looking at? Oh, hey, okay, buddy, folks don't know me, boy. I want all of the beef. I am not vegan. Stop looking at me, shout it. But, uh, <laughs> hope everybody having a good one. Look at my baby. Look at my baby. My baby is looking cleansed today. <laughs> My baby looking clear as though they ass. Anyway, I came here today to present to you a Linux Mall vlog. It was crazy because out here uh, yesterday for those Jordan 4 taupe things, they say it was a line. First come, first serve in Nike. Nike, what's up? Shout, like, shout it. Nike, why is y'all letting these people wait and stand in the line? I saw people posting that junk on IG like it was actually a big line for Nike. Anyway, the fit today, some slight, nothing crazy, you know what I'm saying? Black Atlanta hat, plain black t-shirt. I got the uh, tech fleece, uh, gray and black action going on. Y'all ain't gonna see a lot of people wearing these right here. And that's that Air Tech Talents 2 Black Lava Andre Agassi. Things, man. You ain't gonna see them that much cleansed in my humble opinion. It was in my top 10 sneakers of 2020. Fire fire to me to me you beat me man it's actually slick too hot for some sweats out here man it's like almost 70 degrees out here bro it's balmy out there guy you feel me um hope it stay like that bro i think it's gonna get back cold but in atlanta when the cheat when the uh march april hit you actually have like summer spring and summer day you feel me anyway they're going to the mall Let's see what they got going on, man. I can't believe they make people wait in line at that Nike. I just can't believe that. Let's see. I ain't been to this Nike in a minute. Let's see what they got in here. Do it. Yes. You have the Apple Minions. The Apple Minions are in full effect. Nike's on this side. Nah. That's Apple Express, but it's still a line. Okay. So she didn't let me come in the store down here. This is the exit. And you got to go upstairs for the entrance. So... Now we in here. They had a whole maze to get in here. I had to cut through the maze, man. Cause I went from the, it was nobody in the line and it was like a whole little maze. I saw it too. See, I would've had to walk through all that. I would've had to walk through all that, man. A rat maze. Now these Braves jerseys are hard. I like the gray one. I've always been a fan of the gray one that says Atlanta on the front. Acuna, action, dope jersey. They got the uh, blue guy too, the navy one. Red Maddox. Fire, fire. Pretty action. Got the John Smoltz guy going on. I'm um, glabbing. OG Atlanta Braves action. But what these is, right here? What these is? Got them Sean Witherspoon vibe. These shit. Big as hell, though. Look at boy, What the bottom here, though? What kind of terrain? Is this golf? It's a golf. Oh, it's golf. That's what it is. They put this on the regular Air Max 97. I probably would have copped. That would have made up for the Sean Weatherspoon with all the damn court around now. And they got the Jordan 5s with the same vibes going on, man. What these is? Yeah, no. Golf vibe. Golf guy. So as far as J's, they got these carbon fiber Jordan mids. Carbon fiber drip. Y'all come below and tell me what y'all think of that. I can't mess with them, but hey, patent leather or car it, it ain't patent leather. It's like a carbon fiber type thing. It ain't real carbon fiber, of course. Uh, Familia mids. I don't know what's going on with this drip. It actually slick. I don't know. I'm gonna have to send my wife a picture of these, man. Maybe wife can get down with these guys, bro. Child thing. I think about these vibes. 
I can't do it, but I, I don't know. What the what's going on? What kind of is it collab? What's going on with it? Got the gold joints. They got the Royal Mids. Got those. We got these LeBrons right here. I think they did some kind of drop. Was it a shock drop or access or something for these LeBron? You know, you know, you can go dunking these. That's about it. But I thought somebody might have sneezed on these guys, bro. That's, that's a shoe made like that, bro. Okay, then. Got some more of the OG air raid guys left in here, as well as the jungle colorway. The jungles are hard. I'm gonna be probably mad when they sell out of these and I ain't gonna be able to get them no more, but uh, I got these though. I think that's all I need. All you need are the OGs. These are actually the uh, the uh, blazers I saw in the outlets. Um, they come with the green laces, like that kind of green. Um, now that I saw them outlet prices, I can't buy them retail. It's 110, it still ain't that bad, but they were like $59 at the outlet. <laughs> got some Air Max One action. These are hard. Kind of OG-ish colorway, OG-ish. And then they got the green, like a, it's like a mint green. Fire, got the leather action going on. Be hard. And then they hit them with the Navy. Hit them with the Navy guy. Ooh, ooh. Navy was free. Like, with all the old school braid stuff, I'm surprised they ain't got no Hank Aaron stuff in here. I'm surprised they ain't got no Hank Aaron, man. What Hank Aaron stuff at, bro? But what these Get you some fragment zipper royal black toe strap ankle support jump man. What the is, man? Somebody gonna rock them though. With the pull strap, boy, you got everything you need in these guy, boy. This is an all in one Jordan one. The Trey Young guy, hard. It is Jordan Gill be teasing you, man. Making me think the um, the playoff 13 gonna drop with a little circle around jump, man. Stop teasing me, y'all. I had to sanitize these hands after I touched every damn shoe in there. Uh, <laughs> they put Adidas downstairs now? There you go. They put Adidas downstairs. Adidas used to be upstairs, man. Um, see what else they got going on. In this Hollywood ass mall, man. Get up that cheesecake factory before I leave, man. They got this thing called uh, Buffalo Buffalo Blast or something like that. Hit them guys with some blue cheese, boy. And uh, the only thing I hate about these uh, tech fleece pants is they don't put back pockets on them. So everything that you have, wallet, keys, phone, and all that stuff, you got to put it in your front pockets. And they make them look bulky. They already like super. Um, Slim fit. It'll make your pockets just look bulging like hell. Like people can see the logos on the stuff inside your pocket. <laughs> put a back pocket. Let me put my wallet in the back pocket, man. Come on, Nike. They take fleece. Give me some tech pockets. Got the uh Trey Young All-Star Adidas. He didn't make the team, but he ice Trey in the game with the uh what is this? Superstar? Top 10, top 10. And on the bottom, look at this. Mm -hmm. Ice trade that game. Ice trade that game. Hey, ice trade that game. Hey, you talking about snowing? I wasn't really doing, but I think it's super uh, creative, man. Woof. Blue ice. Man, I was about to give my daughter a pair of these, but it's the last size and it's too small. Ah, daughter was going to be cleansed with the silver toe with her mama, but last size. That Jordan section in that guy ain't nah. They all see the gear. Y'all ain't have to do it like that. Y'all ain't got nah. Now I'm gonna show y'all a little bit of the dining, the fine dining in Lenox Mall. Comment below if you're familiar with any of them. Sweet Hut, Charlie's Philly Steaks, Chipotle, Chick Fil A close on Sunday. Hagen Dodds. Panko Chicken, GW, otherwise known as Gyro and Wings. Checkers, otherwise known as Rallies. Walk Dragon, Five Guys Burgers and Fries. Farmer's Basket, Sarku Japan. Rise Pies, 
and also Saraku Japan Sushi Bar. And ah uh, yes, also in the middle of the food court, Solaris Phone Repair Shop. Are you hungry now? Do you want some of these delicious delectables from that menu? I sure am. I'm going back cheesecake though. You already know what it is. <laughs> Yeah, man, back at the house. I'm full as a bull after eating that cheese cake factory. It was hidden. It was hidden, dog. You feel me? But anyway, real quick, I did want to show y'all the shoe at the end of this video. I was going to save this sneaker for another video, but I decided why not go ahead and show y'all that in this video since the mall didn't have a whole bunch of stuff that was new. We had a couple of things, but um, uh, comment below what y'all think of the food court. I thought that that was interesting that they had all those new food court places I ain't never been to. But anyway, first of all, y'all already know what it is. If you haven't done so already, click the link below because you got to bring them raggedy, dusty, busty shoes back to heaters. You got to bring them beaters back to heaters, man. And the only way to do that is to mess with my folks over there at Rejuvenator. Click the link below in the description. Do that. Um, and use my code MikeRich10 for 10% off your order. A couple of people have been telling me my code is not working and I am looking into it. But a couple of people are telling me that it's working for them. So let me look into it, send a couple of emails out. Title of this email, if y'all know what that's from, comment below. But, um, and I'm gonna try to get uh, my rejuvenator code on point. It's been working for some people, I think. Some people saying it ain't, but you're gonna have to pick up your rejuvenator products. This is one of the new things that they got right here. This is the, um, the drying rack and bowl combo. I'm thinking that this drying rack, show y'all this thing, is for your brushes to get dry. You just sit your brushes. Sit your brushes in this drying rack right here. Let's get one of the brushes so I can show y'all exactly what I'm talking about. And it'll um, let your brushes dry out, man. Just sit it right there. Like so, sit that brush, boom, in that rejuvenator drying rack. Also, I got your rejuvenator brush game going hard, hard, tough, tough. Sit that thing in the drying rack and let them dry after you scrub them shoes down and get all that dusty, mugusty out them things. Also, it doubles as a bowl, as a bowl, so you can put your sneaker cleaner in there and cleanse your shoes, your solution, and your warm, lukewarm, lukewarm water. You feel me? The rejuvenator plug is complete without me talking about the rejuvenator wipes all the time. Like I said, rejuvenator wipes never leave home without it. I had these um, on me today. I didn't have to use them on the Agassiz. I didn't have to use them on the Tech Challenge guys, but they were on deck just in case I needed them. So anyway, click the link below in the description. Use my code MikeRich10 for 10% off your order. If it does not work, please comment below in, uh, in the comment section or DM me and I will try to get that code working. I think it's working for most people, but comment below if you're having trouble using it. So with that being said, gotta get into the shoes. Hey, I have not even checked these out yet, bro. I ain't even checked these out yet. Shout out to my guy Retro Red. I want to see these in hand. They sold out instantly on sneakers out like everything else, especially in the Jordans. But these right here. Some of the dopest packaging, Jordan packaging ever. I love the way they package these sneakers right here. And they have that real new shoe cleansed, fresh scent to them, man. I can use that, that scent. I can use that scent for um, air freshener. So they wrapped up like sandwiches, and this is my first time checking these out of hand. I hope I can get them right back in this paper right for my guy Retro. Speaking of Retro, real quick. If y'all coming to Atlanta next weekend, All-Star uh, Game Sunday, my guy Retro Rick will be showing, uh, having the sneaker pop-up shop, AKA Retro Con. Come down, all you, you, everybody is gonna be coming out. Your boy Mike Rich is gonna be there. I'm gonna bring my wife. We gonna have, we gonna, we gonna be there for a second. You know what I'm saying? For the festivities. Your boy got, he got a lot of stuff going on. He got retail vibes going on the sneakers. Some of the shoes gonna be retail. Some of them gonna be slight resale, but he ain't gonna be busting nobody's head. Shoes you might've missed out on. My guy Retro Rick gonna have. See, yo, he got over like 50 or 60 pairs of sneakers. So y'all come down there and check it out and it'll be other stuff going on as far as All Star related merch all kind of stuff man dopeness y'all please come in the city if you're gonna be in atlanta retro con pop-up shop come and support my guy down here in atlanta all-star weekend they will have upstairs and downstairs they'll be playing the game 
uh, the All-Star Game there if you want to stay there for that stuff like that. But it's going to be fire. It's going to be lit. It's going to be what they call it? A movie. A feature film. You feel me? Shout out to Retro. But let's get into these shoes, man. They looking fire in hand. <laughs> Whoa. Bow! The Air Jordan 1 Comfort PSG, guys. You feel me? Zoom Comfort PSG Air Jordan 1's colorway is white, black, and psychic purple? That's psychic? Psychic purple, I guess. Anyway, there they are right there in their glorious, glorifying glory. These things look really, really nice in hand, man. I seen them on pictures, I was like, they all right. But I didn't realize they had the, the kind of cream or light tanned, really, really nice suede on them. And then they got this swoosh that just don't know what color it wanna be. You holding certain lights, Ain't doing it right now, but you heard that swoosh and certain lights, man. It just kind of like change colors, man. Uh, you put, like I said, you put certain lights on in the back. You got that Paris logo going. You got this, um, like I said, crazy like purplish and pink mixture material at the top, as well as on the uh, Jumpman wing logo right there. Like I said, this swoosh, it ain't doing it right now. I can't get it to do it, but it be changing colors as well i just thought this was a different shoe it did sell out some people were saying that they was trash i actually liked the shoe i was trying to get a pair for my wife uh also has the paris on the lace tips right here very dope shoe like i, I really just like the materials more than anything on the inside you got the paris action going on on the inside fire this is a size 11 and a half so these are in men's sizes um, and they only, I think they come with extra laces. Let me check. Got this, I think they come with like two extra laces. Uh, I'm gonna have to wrap these shoes back up. <laughs> All right, this one right here comes with the pink and the purple laces. Like I said, you got pink and purple lace gang going strong, strong. You feel me? Cleansed in my humble opinion. Y'all comment below and tell me what you think of these. Like I said, when I first saw them, I was like, they are right. I don't know how my daughter is calling me. Yes. I can't find the remote. Come here. You can't find the remote. You just had the remote in your hand, Harley. You gonna say hey to the people? Hi. Say hello. Hello. Why are you doing your hair like that? <laughs> you sweep it to the side. You sweep it to the side. All right, I'll come in and get your remote in a minute, okay? Okay. Watch TV until I come back. You okay? But I know, but I will come in a minute. Can I finish doing my video first? Okay. Well, I'll I find you. Ugh. I'll be right back. Yep, she's a handful. The uh, remote was right beside her. Anyway, the bottoms are got that purple action going on. A lot of these Zoom Comforts have this kind of like two-tone bottom. Like I said, really good suede materials that they put on these. Very, very dope shoes in my humble opinion. I wouldn't rock them myself. It's just because of the slight pink and purple vibes going on. I think they'll be a better shoe for the wife, but I am feeling them. It's weird because shoes with these colorways be it's men's sizes and then shoes that we want, a lot of shoes that we want be women's sizes. So anyway, these right here are fire. I do like this shoe. Y'all comment below and tell me what y'all think of them. The PSG Air Jordan 1, I, of course I prefer when you're talking PSGs, I do prefer the PSG Air Jordan 4. Anyway, I appreciate y'all for checking this video out. Comment below anything that you liked in the mall vlog part of the video. Comment below if you're actually feeling these shoes right here that I gotta actually wrap back up like I'm working at Wendy's trying to wrap a, sound, uh, wrap a burger up. It's Paris on the tips of these other laces too. Fire. Anyway, man, appreciate y'all for watching. Hit that thumbs up, like, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Hit the notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up to the moon on them. Um, wait a minute. Clank, clank. Had to get these a stamp of approval. The uh, giveaway, um, the giveaway for the for the Jordan Fours, don't look like it's gonna happen. Y'all ain't hitting. It ain't. The the video barely getting a lot of views. Plus, it I, like I really don't see it reaching three thousand. Like, like fifteen hundred right now. I really don't see it reaching 3,000. If it do, I'ma still give away this shoe, and if not, I 
reach for 3,000 views, 3,000 likes, my bad, on another video, man. So that's going on with the giveaway. Anyway, I appreciate y'all for watching. Keep watching my video, because that's what I'm here for. Go Mike, Rich, no hype, just kicks. Jordan, six, eight, and nine, fit.